sports preview. Both your men and women's soccer teams began their WAC tournament. Let's take a look at how they did and take a look at how the other Panthers did as well. Women's soccer beat Concordia 5-0 and Madonna 1-0. They advanced to the finals of the WAC tournament. They will play University of Northwestern Ohio this Friday on the DU turf field. Basketball traveled to Iowa where they won against Stork College and Northwestern College. Dominus Burnett had a total of 39 points during the trip. The team will now travel to Mary Grove this Saturday. Women's Volleyball defeated Cornerstone 3-1, earning them second place going into the WAC tournament. They will travel to Madonna University this Friday to begin the WAC tournament. The men's D1 hockey team traveled to Kent State University where they split games. In the second game, Mason Bolinger had a hat trick and Matt Peldis had a shutout. Their next home game is this Saturday at 3.30 against Oakland. The women's rugby team traveled to Ohio to partake in the USA Rugby 7 National. They went 1-2. This puts their overall record at 8-2. In soccer took on Concordia in the WAC quarterfinal. The Panthers won 5-3 with Dino Duratovic scoring two of the goals. Their next game is Tuesday at 7 p.m. against Madonna. Men's Rugby traveled to Arkansas to play in their Sevens Invitationals. They went 2-1 winning over Oakland and Linwood. They are now 4-2 overall. Basketball won against Northwood University 94-73 and Cardinal Stitch University 64-60. This puts the team at a record of 4-0. They will travel to Mary Grove this Saturday. Men's D3 hockey team defeated Saginaw Valley State 6-3 and 10-2. Donald Sun had a hat trick during the second game. The team will now take on Adrian College this Friday at 8-20. Both men's and women's cross-country teams finished 5th in the WAC Championship. Stacey Barron came in 10th for the women with a time of 19-15-17. Be sure to come out and support your Panthers in their WAC Tournament Finals this week.